Brent means everything to me. It was a pleasure growing up here. It was fun, you know, like every child, you always on your bike, always out and about. But I just love how I had friends from all different walks of life, you know. It's always good to be able to connect with different people. Grow up and learn different people's cultures and background, but also take it with you in your life as well. As a kid, my dream was to play in the Premier League. Win a Premier League and play for England. Having Wembley Stadium so close to you and always knowing it's right in your backyard, that was always a massive dream of mine. I was up against it from minute one and kept going. Always had people that told you that you can't do this, I can't do that. And always said I can and I continue to break those barriers. As you get older, you have different ambitions, you have different goals you want to reach to, and every year there's new goals I set myself. Winning the biggest competitions, the Champions League, winning something for your country, I think that'll be the biggest achievement of my career if I can be part of a winning England team. One day, hopefully, I can win the Ballon d'Or. Seeing the Messi's Ronaldo's lifting is something that you see and something that you want to emulate the best you can. One big thing of mine is to give back to the communities that I grew up in to set up my academy there, to give them an opportunity because they were a bit of guidance and the right help. A lot of kids can also have the same dream as me and a lot of kids out there do. I just feel if people and kids around areas like this have full belief in themselves and know that there's more in this world, everything's possible. Once you put your dedication and your time and effort into something that you truly believe you're good at, you will succeed. To have that connection with young kids, being that age and you remember your idols and if one of them came to play with you in a park, you'd be over the moon and it's good to be able to have that connection, show them love and the more you have positive and inspirational people around you, the more you have people that achieve their goals, the more you go after yours. The best message you can get across is being yourself and speaking openly but also positively as well. For me to be able to do that for my borough will be nothing but a true blessing for me. Having Raheem at our school was an absolute privilege. He's just like an amazing player and he's just a role model to so many people. Despite all the negative that he had, he still managed to become one of the best footballers in the world. People didn't really have good opportunities and now he's showing everyone that like, he can be something. And it doesn't matter where you come from. <laughs>